Hiya! Thank you for joining us virtually for one of Mimra's classes. Um, this class has been recorded from a Zoom class that we did, which is an app where we can be more interactive with participants. But then we had requests to put it available on YouTube for those who can join us um, for that class. So it's a little bit weird because it's recorded from an interactive class. Uh, so maybe some of it won't make sense or will you know, mention things on the camera that doesn't quite make sense for you in your living room. Um, but we hope it's useful for you to keep you moving, to have some fun. And if you want to join us for our interactive classes, they are on Tuesdays. And please sign up if you email info at mimbre.co.uk. Um, brilliant. Enjoy the class. Take care. Listen to your body. Have fun. First, we're going to do a dance warm up. Then we're going to continue to work a bit on the sofas. So actually, what will be useful is just checking who has a sofa and who, or a bed. So would you be okay to get like a chair later when we're doing acrobatics and work on a chair? Cool. And if you have like more of an armchair or anything like that that you could drag into the room, that'd be good. Just have, you have more space to work on. But just whatever you have, it, it, we can do it. Cool. Now that's it. Over to you, Natasha. Let's dance. Right. So we are going to um, do a warm up and then we're going to try some of the moves out on the, on the chairs. All right, lovely. Move back. Find a space. Just bend your knees. Go, bend your knees. Take it into your shoulders. Clever, make your knees go forward. So that way, that's it. Forward. More arms to my up. Let's go faster. Go. Into your shoulders. Really pop it. One leg out. One leg in. One leg out. And again. Let's go a little bit faster. Go. Use your shoulders. Use your arms. Give me two to the right. Go. Two to the left. Two to the right. Two to the left. Squash and fly. Other leg. Double bounce. Slide it around your room. Into your shoulders. Big shoulder rolls. Go a bit faster. And if you want to do the shoulders on the couch, you could on the way up. Or you can sit down on your couch. Look at Lena in front of you. Well done. Go a bit faster. Still keep moving if you're on the couch. Like get those shoulders going. Good. Let's take a seat then. Let's do our ribs. So you're going to reach. Really reaching. Tummy in. And then coming forward again. Make it funky. That's a really good tester to see if you're using your ribs and not your hips. Give me forward and back. And curve. Open and curve. Good. To the side. Grab it back. Making that letter C. Catching a ball in your tummy. Dust it off. You should push your shoulder up first. Good. Give me the smirk. Really bounce it. Side smirk. Kind of leaning away from it. Give me a prep. All the way. Sinking into your feet as well. Side punches. Use your tummy. Strong. Pushing it over. Crisscross. Ready to go. Tap, tap. Quick, quick. Alice, use your arms. Moving, tap, tap, and bouncing, tap, tap, and bouncing. Good, hands on your hips, bend your knees. Give me circles as if you were keeping a hula hoop going. Good, go the other way, hula hoops. 
Show me the hips. We're going to get really warm today. We're going to do some fun stuff in the couch. Pop side to side, hips. Use your arms, pop in. Really focus on the hips. Go faster, hip. Use your elbows. Take a walk around the room. Get to your couch, your chair. Strike pose. And come back, have a little boogie. Go to your chair again. Maybe you might do a little kick on it. Come back. Have a little boogie. Do those two again. For the first one, do a little shake. And then come back, have a boogie. And then do your other one. Do a little handstand thing. Hey, yeah. lovely. All right, let's have a quick stretch before we do our heads. Breathe in, breathe out, and again. And then roll down through your body. Heavy head, straight legs. Stay there. Breathe out, have a swing. And then bend your knees. And stretch. And again. Slowly roll up. Have a wiggle. And then we're going to do the woolly bounce and you lean over and do your taps. Spill in your hips. Asya, get lower. Low, low. Stay low. Body low. Body low. Two. Body mass. Give me the tap. Go faster. Go. Swing it. Into your knees, pull your tummy in, double it up, and single strong arms. Do that again. One more. Come a bit closer to the camera. Heads, floor, centre, and again to your side. Standing really tall, shoulders back, tummy in, chicken head, come up to the camera, turn and face someone, turn and face someone else, good, Egyptian head, put your hands there, you're leaning over, Good, Sophie. <laughs> All right, we're going to do some waving. You got your wrist, your elbow, shoulder into your wrist. Well done, Alice. Shoulder and elbow and wrist. Let's go faster. Go, wrist, elbow, shoulder, wrist, shoulder. Even faster, go! Other way. Now make it smooth. 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 Into the ripples, down and up. Remember when we're doing head, chest, and rolling down. And then rolling up, rolling down. Rolling up. Rolling down, and the reverse one's the easy one. So head up, lift up in your chest, chin back, and roll down. And then reverse it, roll up, and roll down, and roll up. Good, have a little freestyle. Get back with the couch, do something else. Try doing like a pose. Like a breaking pose. Come back. Pose, legs apart, and back. And try turning all the way around. And come back. Other way, all the way around. And come back. And have a little boogie. Let's do kick and back. Kick together back. If you know that one, 
If you're not sure of your steps, don't worry. I'll do it this way as well. So you're going to do kicks together, one leg back. If you know it, go fast already. Back, use your arms. You've got kicks together, back. One more, kick together. Let's go fast, I'm going to face you. Kick together, back. Don't worry if you're not sure. We'll work on this every week. And then we're going to go arms out and across. Out and across. So now your feet don't move. Try that one on your couch. Move back towards your couch. Sit down. Arms out and across. Try the way. Into a lead. And then way back. Into a lead. Good. Have a little freestyle. Marching. Give me some jumping jacks for your cardio. Strong. Good. Spotted dog. Double spotted dog. Use your arms. Jumping jacks. Last time. Come on. Let's go. Good. Spotted dog. Funky. Turn around. Turn around. Quarter turn. Other way. Go. Tap it out, slide it. Or just tap it out. Get your breath back, shoulders. All right, good. Grab a swig of water. Woo. If you grab a swig of water and then we'll go over the routine. I wasn't what I was thinking doing jumping jacks and spotted dogs. I'm gonna pass out. Okay, <laughs> okay, so the routine we did, we'll go over it once and then we'll do it music once. Okay, so we went this way, we turn to our right, so five, or oh, if anyone's not done it, just, just follow me. You slide around for four eights, okay? So you're going to go, oh, da da da, oh, da da, oh, da da, and then you do four more like that, and then you do the turns. I'll tell you when, then turn six. Seven, go, step, turn, step, Egypt. And make sure you've got nice wrists and your back leg is bent. Go the other way, step, turn, step, Egypt. And again, have a look in the camera and check your shape is like my shape. Good, and then you do smurf. Smurf on the right arm, smurf on the left arm, take it to the side right arm, to the side left arm. Then you do squash a fly on the right leg and come back a little bit. You go, squash a fly, frame your face, squash a fly, frame your face, jump out, one, drop down, two, arm strong, three, check your shape of your hands, close it, four, come up, toe, heel, toe, heel, then you do your right arm, cross, shoulder, away and down, cross, shoulder, away and down, Cross, shoulder, away and in. Right arm, remember we worked on this shape last week. Check in the mirror. I mean, check in your camera. And if you're on YouTube, just check with somebody or take a photo of yourself. Change it into prayer position and out you go. Then you do the other one, the left arm. Cross and shoulder and away and down. Cross and shoulder and away and down. Cross and shoulder and away and in. This time it's the right arm that flips, check that shape. Then the left arm, check that shape. Look at that, I'm really working hard on my top hand to make it that square, it's really hard. And, I, and the same for my underneath hand. Like to take the top hand away from your head a little bit so you're not, so you've got that space. So your underneath arm, bring it up a bit. So you take your underneath arm away from your hip. So I've got a little bit of space. 
and then you go to prayer and you explode it down. The one bit with the music that is really quick is those four shapes. So when you've done squash a fly, frame your face, squash a fly, frame your face. Go one, go two, go three, go four, close five, six, seven, and we go and across and a shoulder and a out and down. Cross and shoulder and out and down. Cross and shoulder and away and in. And a right arm, left arm, explode, left arm. Cross and shoulder and away and down. Cross and shoulder and away and down. Cross and shoulder and away and in. Ta, ta, woo! Touch your head if you're okay with that. Uh, and then I want you to hook your nose if you want me to go through it again. Go, ah, uh, ah, uh, if you want me to go through it again. Same place again though, okay? Let's go from the top, sliding around the room. Sliding, and you're sliding, and you're doing it with style, and you're doing it with attitude, style, sliding. Then you've got your turn. Go, step, turn, step, and shape. Step, turn, step, and shape. Pull back this leg, zoom your left leg, and smurf on the right, smurf on the left, smurf on the right, Smurf on the left and you double bounce. Frame your face. Squash a fly. Frame your face. Go one, go two, go three, go four. Close five, six, seven, eight. And across and shoulder and away and down. Across and shoulder and away and down. Both and shoulders and away and in. Drop the right arm. Drop the left arm. Explode and down. Other arm. Cross and shoulder and away and in. Cross and shoulder and away and in. Cross and shoulder and away and in. And left arm, right arm, explode and down. Good in, yeah, we can try. Let's try it once to music as it is, and then we'll try it on the couch. Here we go. Sliding. Well, let me just turn it off. Keep going. Sliding. Sliding, sliding, sliding. It's your turn to your right. Go. Up. Wash a fly. Frame your face. And again. Quick, go. Right arm. Left arm. Both arms, up, up, and left arm. You can bounce if you've got it. Good. All right, we're gonna try doing the second half on the couch. So, we're gonna go, we're gonna go from jump out, turn it out, slowly. Here we go, jump out. Turn it out, and here, and up, come in, and on, we can go fast on that bit, go both, Woo come back, other arm, <laughs> <laughs> Good. Let's try it from the from that bit again. So from the jump out, six. Here you go. Slow jump out. Turn it out. Arms up. Prayer position. Go knees and toes. Knees and toes. Knees, toes and heels. Go arm, arm out. Arm, arm out. Both, both out, in, right, left, away. Come back, have a wave. Other arm. And come back, and come back. Okay, good. So sitting on your sofas, we're going to build a little bit on that one. As you explode, can you lean back and take your right leg over your left? Put your hands by your side. Okay? 
And then I want to see, I'm pushing into the sofa a bit. It depends, like you might want to lean back a little bit. And I'm changing leg. And make that change quite big. So see like how big can you make the leg as you shake them, change them over, but still make it fast. So I go Wah. And I think it helps also to flex the feet to the camera rather than pointing them. It's like flex. Show the feet to the camera. Yeah. Great. So we're going to, so we're going to start. It's a bit weird when you do zoom because it mirrors the image, but I'm starting with my right leg over. So I go over and then I look back the way I came from. So I look to my left, look and back at the camera. And then the left leg goes over and I go look back and look at the camera. Okay. And so they're quite fast. We'll do them like to count, which is like this. I'll show you first. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, and two, three, four, Five and six, seven, eight. Yeah. Cool. Let's try that together. Don't worry. Like there's a little bit of a delay when you see yourself in the Zoom. So you might not see yourself directly, but don't worry about it. We'll try it together. You just do it from my voice. Okay. Ready? Five. Uh, right leg over. Hands by side. Five, six, seven, eight. One and two. Look, look. Three and four. Look, look. Yeah. Cool. From here. Undo your feet, legs on the floor, and put your hands by the side here. Yeah, so that's a one. And then I cross over with my right arm on top, two, so the elbows are underneath, the hands are together. And I take one hand up, put it by my face, three, and another one, four. And then I do this thing where I push the heel of my hand. It's, it's similar to some of the stuff you know with Natasha. I push the heels of my hand together. So they come into like here. And when I do that, that makes my elbow push my knees out. So I actually go up on the side of my feet. So I go from here, I push down and that push, pushes the knees out. So you go whoop and up. And then, that's a five and six. And then I just go like this. I just go like this with my fingers. Yeah? <laughs> On your face. So that's a seven and eight. So, we'll do that together. We go one and two, three, four, five and six, seven, eight. We go one and two and three and four. Push five and six and Fingers and fingers. Yeah? Cool. One more time, a little bit faster. So we go from, you've gone from here, explode, and bring one, the right leg over. Okay. And then we go five, faster. Five, six, seven, eight. One and two, look, look. Five and six, look, look. Hands and hands and head and head and down and up. Fingers, fingers. That was quite fast. So we explode it, come back. Okay, let's try it together. Uh, ready? Five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three, four, five and six, seven, eight. One and two, three and four. If everyone was with me. Five and six, and then fingers, seven, eight. Yeah? Great. Okay, now let's go into some um, upside down things. This might be tricky on this chair. So I'll show what everyone else is doing and I think you should lie on the floor instead. So for this one, I'm going to lie around in the sofa and I'm going to look at the camera through the, like upside down. I think you should just lie on the floor in front of your chair, like that. Yeah, because I think the, the chair, you want to sit on the chair. Okay, is everyone there with me? Cool. And then here, what I want to see is what you can do with your legs upside down. So go into a split with arms out to the side, like a straddle, and bring your legs to careful, <laughs> so you don't fall out. And bring your legs, like hands together with legs apart and the legs apart and see what happens if you knot your knee your legs up and then knot your arms 
and change that around. And maybe yeah, play with like, you can see yourself in the camera, play with like, what if you cross your arms and then cross your legs, cross and cross. So, <laughs> so just play with like creating patterns if you can with your arms and your legs. Great. Oh, and come out of that. Huh. It makes my head quite tired. <laughs> Great. Let's do a quick bit of stretching. And I'm going to try all this to uh, another piece of music as well. And you're going to get to create your own pieces. So first a little bit of stretching. Hands and knees on the floor. And we're going to curve the back and arch the back. So just a like happy cow, angry cat. There. Yeah. And then you tuck your legs under. So you have your feet and your hands on the floor. And then from here, going to put the elbows down and coming through. So here. So it comes through here and stretch like a cobra. And then pull the belly button up. And come through and stretch like a cobra. And then pull the belly button up. And come through and stretch like a cobra. And pull your belly button up. And you're just going to walk your wrists. Your wrists around. And shake out your hands. Now, um, let's do uh, just a little bit of your rolls just to prepare our, our core. So, putting the hands on your knees. Make sure you have space behind you. So I just move that chair or I'll move back in front of here. Uh, either if you have a carpet, that's fine. Otherwise, have a little mat or something, just a rug. You're going to roll back and come up without putting your feet on the floor. So hands are on the knees, feet down. Roll and hold and roll and hold and roll and hold. And now go straight legs and roll and hold and roll and hold and roll and hold and roll and hold and try to just put your hands by your side and roll and come up and roll and come up and roll and come up and then cycling and one Two, opposite knees to opposite hands. Three, four, I mean, knees to elbow. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Clap on the other leg. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Great. Cool. Okay. So we're going to recap. A little bit of the acrobatic moves that we did in the sofa last week and then I want to put like some of the choreography that we just did together with those moves together with your own moves that you can make up. Um, before doing that could everyone do a bridge to warm up their bridges? <laughs> put their hands by their side, by their shoulders if you have long hair you should have it tied up and then push the hips up. Great and stretch. And so you can stretch by pulling a bit. You're pushing this way with your chest. You have to do that yourself. Just rock back and forth a bit. And if you can, put one leg up and hold the balance and try both sides. So one leg on each side up. Great. And then when you come down, you can do them in your sofa, yeah. When you come down, you just rock your, you rock your back a little bit again. Just hug your knees to your, hug your knees to your chest. And just rock back here, just set it down. Great. Now, so the first move was doing it against the sofa. So you're going to stand in front of your sofa. So if you have a chair, you can do it against the chair. And just make sure that the chair is blocked against the wall or something. So you're going to go pushing the knees forward and then reaching back and be a bit more like a sofa like. 
So if this against the chair, so you can see it's sideways, then I'm, <laughs> I'm, whoops, <laughs> I'm pushing my knees forward to come back here, and I create like more of a like a bit like a bridge with my with my back. Yeah. So you can come from here, push the knees, push my hips, go back. Yeah, and you can go into a full bridge on the sofa if you want to. Yeah, so in that case, do you want to show it? In that case, first you go back with one hand, and then the other arm walks around into the bridge, and then see, find a way out of that. Not onto your head. <laughs> There's no onto your head, so you can turn out of it. Okay. And then the other way we did was to have their feet on the sofa. Feet on the sofa. And then you take one foot and go in towards the sofa. Cross it over. No, 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 other, other one. That one. No. And then the other arm you reach towards the camera. So you get like a nice halfway bridge here. Hello. And do it the other way. So I'm just gonna say I don't know if you can see my legs. That's it, like that. So you're showing with my feet. My feet are here. So if I'm on the chair, one foot is crossing over the other, and then I turn my body that way. So I get into like a half bridge like that. And then come back and you bring that foot back. And then I do the same on the other one. I cross the leg the way I want to go and then I allow the turn to the feet to turn as I roll on the sofa. And it's always nice when you do it that you then look towards the like look towards the camera, look towards the audience. Hello great ones. Then let's do the handstands against the sofa. But let's see if you're doing it with the um, camera straight in front of you, let's see <laughs> if you can do your handstand so you're turning a bit sideways. So feet on the sofa, hands by the side, and then see if you can turn that so you can look at the camera, look, or, or if you're on YouTube, look towards the TV. So just play with the shapes that you can do. If you got an armrest, maybe you can do it up in the sofa as well. So you push it to the side, and then see if you can have one leg up and the shape looking, turning your body towards the camera. You get like nice shapes there. Yeah, and let's go on to the headstands. So the headstands is either just make sure you have a um, just make sure you have something in the back. If you if your sofa has like a void at the end of it, then you need to have an adult to stand there to, to support you. So the headstand could either be okay, when you go into the headstand, push your hands and here like that. With the, with my back is going against the back of the against the seat of sofa. Or you could do it in the sofa, coming up into the sofa, my pushing head. my head to the so, uh, back of sofa, going up there. Also, if you have a corner, it's quite nice to use the corner of the sofa and pushing up there. Nice. And really, even though it's so soft in the, in the sofa, really make sure to push with your hands so that you're active with your hands. So yeah, don't slip your head down too much. Make sure your back of your head is right against the seat of the sofa. Very good. Okay, great. And then just quickly, um, let's just do the forward rolls in the sofa as well. So, you go one end of the sofa, and Clement, I think you had a little mat on the floor, didn't you? So if you just do them on the floor, so either you do it on the rug on the floor, at which point you come up to standing up there, or if you're on the sofa, you need to make it really small and not necessarily come up standing. You put your hands, you push, so you look through your legs up to the ceiling, roll, and you end up in a little tuck there on the sofa. So you can fit it really small. So you sit at one end, you, you can sit on arm to rest or just on here. And then push with your hands so you can open up your legs, look through your legs, and roll through. And while we're here, having landed in the roll, and this you can do to the chair as well, um, if you're on a chair. Reaching your legs out to the open side and rolling down on the floor, just bending the knees, bending down. And to come up on the sofa, you push up, put your bum up, push on your feet and your hands, 
paint the ceiling until you're lying on the sofa or the bed or the chair. So you roll up and then you roll up. Cool. Nice ones. What I'll do now is I want you to find three positions in the sofa which shows the way you've been feeling for the last few weeks. So I want you to find three positions in the sofa that shows how you've been feeling. So maybe, you know, when you haven't been able to go to school and you've been home, so maybe you got one, maybe you've been bored. Maybe you've been watching TV. Maybe you've been sleeping more than normal. Or maybe you've been like really excited, like being able to do things at home. I don't know. Have a think about like, just choose three position in the sofa that shows things you've been doing. So just normal position, like, you know, what people would, the way people would sit in the sofa. Okay, anyone who's on a chair, you do exactly the same on a chair. Yeah, so on a chair, you just choose, you have three different positions. Could be like sitting, waiting. Could be like feeling lazy. Could be like being a bit worried. Ah, don't fall off. Okay. So make up three positions and you'll see how you can go from one of those to the next one and to the next one. Yeah? So just normal one. Don't go acrobatic yet. Just, just sitting positions. And try to make them quite different so it's like clear that they're different ones. Cool. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put on the music and I'm going to see if you can move between those three positions with the music. So see if you can hold each position for eight beats. So it might be... I need to keep this up. Come to your last position. Can everyone go into your last position? I now want you to put together at least between three and five of your own moves. It can be dancing, so it could be like if you're sitting here, you might want to go into like the like um, these moves that we were doing. Yeah, or if you maybe your position is uh, uh, like Dylan's already uh, upside down, he might want to do some of the leg dancing and make your own like choreography with the legs. Or you can start to add some acrobatic moves. So you might want to go from there. Uh, and if you're on a chair, you can just use, you can just use the floor as well as the sofa. You might want to go from there, into there, into there, into here, yeah? So just take a little time to like create your own little dance. Only like five moves. Just put five moves together. That's great. You can use some of the choreography. So just have a think about like what what different dancing can you do in the sofa. So let's just let's just pull it together a little bit uh, together. So what about what about we start with uh, with uh, hand choreography? I'm going to turn it towards my sofa again. Me and Ronnie got different sofas. Okay? And. So let's say that we're here, Whoa. and we're going here. So let's start with this one together. So we go one and two, three, four, five and six, look, look. Hands on the knee, hands cross around, hand on the face, on the face, and we push through into like arms here in the middle, and then push up again, and then fingers here. And then I want you to see if you can do this one. Hands on the knees, push the knees together, shift the hands around over. So now they're an opposite knee. And then push them together, you slide them back and try to do the shift of the hands as smooth as you can so people hardly notice it. 
So here I slide them across, and when they meet, I just open. I open up my right hand so this left one can sneak under, and I can change the knees. And you just go see if you can play with that. Yeah, great, and a little bit of dancing. Great. Yeah. So I think it'd be great if we could do that first. If we could start from here. Whoa. And we so explosion, right leg across. And we go together. Five, six, seven, eight. And change. And look. Sorry, 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 sorry. I'll do it fast. Uh, I'll do it proper count. I have to count one, two, three. I'd rather get lost. Right leg across. Five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three, four. Five and six, seven, eight, and arms, knees, hand, hand, push up, fingers crossed, and hands to the knees, and cross, and and cross, and and cross, and cross, dance in the place, dance in the place, dance in the place. Huh. Cool. So, what I want you to do is go to your sofa position one. Sofa position one. What's your first sofa position? Sofa position two. Your own, your own, your own, the own, the, your own three positions. How you've been feeling? Your own different position of sitting. So two, and then sofa position three. And from sofa position three, I want you to move into sitting up. And then we do the, that uh, with your right leg over. Okay, so this is your fourth position. Okay, so we go first, your own positions, your first three positions. I'll do it again. First position, one. Your second position, two. Your third position, three. Come up, explode, leg across. And then we go one, two, three, and four, five, and six. Seven, eight, hands and hands and head and head, down, up, fingers going and go, crossing your legs, crossing your legs, and then you just dance in your own place. And now from here, I just want to see your like the, the moves that you put together. So from here, what do you do? Do you like go into a headstand? And you keep going with the rhythm, take it back, take it back. What was your other moves? Did you do the forward roll? Did you do the dancing with your legs? You do the turning upside. Using the, you can use the floor as well, remember? Just playing around with what your other acrobatic moves are. If you could get like three acrobatic moves in there, that would be great. You don't have to be more than that. Clement, remember? Remember these moves as well, where you put like your feet on this on the chair, and you get like one one arm up. You can do like nice shapes there. Three of your own sitting positions or lying down. Then we get together and we do the like the swapping of the legs, yeah, and the looking with the heads. And then after that, you do three or five acrobatic moves in the sofa or dancing, yeah. It can be it can be dance move or it could be acrobatic moves, doesn't matter. So sitting, sitting positions. Sitting positions, one, two, three, whatever you've done. And then we get together here, and then we do the legs, dag, 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 Yeah, and then you start to like dance around, dance around, and use that dancing to go into your acrobatic moves. Yeah? Whatever moves you have, your shapes. I say you do some really nice shapes. Uh, it could be if you get lost, just do like your dance moves, headstand forward rolls, head handstands. Cool. Head, head, hands on the head if that makes sense. Okay, and I'm going to shout out first position, second position, third position. Okay, what? Ready. First position. And third position. And come to the front legs, right leg over. Five, six, five, six, seven, swap. And swap. And lift. And swap. And lift. And hand. Hand. Here. Here. Push. Huh. Do 
your fingers and land on your legs and change and change and change and faster and change and dance in your place and do your acrobatics any chance you want And come forward to the camera. Come to the camera and give me your dancing faces and give me your crazy faces and give me your bored faces while dancing and give me your happy and give me your excited faces. Cool! And say goodbye! Bye! Thank you very much. We hope you enjoyed that class. Um, if you did and if you're able, we'd really appreciate any donation, small or big, details below. Um, also, if you want to join the live Zoom interactive classes, uh, please email us on info at member.co.uk or follow the link below. And also on the member use YouTube channel, there is an acrobatic playlist where you can access more challenges of acrobatic tricks now that you're warmed up. Um, so yeah, enjoy. Hope to see you next week. Bye!